Hi guys, welcome back to Abubu. Today we have a very exciting tea. It's from one of our tea farmers we work with. His name is Kentasan, and he has produced a very, very delicious gyokuro. But before we go any further, I just want to remind you to go below, click subscribe, and also hit the bell icon. This really helps us with being able to share Japanese tea with people around the world. You can also find the captions below for English or Japanese. We filmed the harvest, the processing, and also our brewing as well. So follow us along and enjoy watching the production of this job. Kentasan harvested the tea in that beautiful remote tea field and also his processing in his factory as well. Now we're going to be brewing the tea. Now this tea had a little bit of a slightly deeper steaming and this means it's got a beautiful round flavour to accompany that umami flavour that you're going to get from it. So we get our five grams, we want to cool the water down to around 
50 to 60 degrees Celsius and you can do that by pouring it from uh, vessel to vessel and after that we want to brew the tea so I'm going to brew along with you uh, please enjoy watching the next segment and let's enjoy together delicate high notes are just unmistakably Wazaka Gyokuro. And lastly, I just want to say a very big thank you to all of our Tea Club members who support us and allow us to be able to do all the wonderful things we're doing in Wazaka and also bringing more Japanese tea to people around the world. Without you, it would not be possible. So thank you so much. And if you don't know about the Tea Club, then please check in the links below and you can find out more. So from everybody at Abubu, thank you so much, and I hope you really, really enjoyed this tea.